are discussing about the gate 1995C paper and the topic we are discussing is electronic devices. The drift velocity of electrons in silicon A is proportional to electric field for all values of electric field is independent of electric field increases at low values of electric field and decreases at high values of electric field exhibiting negative differential resistance d increases linearly with electric field at low values and gradually saturates at higher values of electric field so simply this question is going to be related to the drift velocity of electrons and silicon with respect to electric field how the drift velocity varies with respect to electric field the correct option for this question is D. Drift velocity of electrons increases linearly with electric field at low values and gradually saturates at higher values of electric field. We will see the details now. <coughs> Drift velocity of electrons in silicon is given by V is equal to mu into electric field. V is equal to mu into E. V stands for drift velocity of electrons mu is nothing but mobility of charge carriers units for that one is centimeter square per volt second and E is nothing but electric field units are volt per centimeter so if we are going for smaller electric fields if the electric field is less than 10 power 3 volt per meter then mu is constant that is mobility of the electrons is not affected when the electric field is going to be less than 10 power 3 volt per centimeter so mu is treated as constant directive you can write it as v is proportional to electric field as electric field increases v increases linearly so the relation between v and electric field velocity and electric field is linear for small values of electric field when the electric field is in between 10 power 3 to 10 power 4 volt per centimeter if the electric field is in between these values by that time mobility is going to be affected by the electric field mobility reduces how it is reduces is nothing but mu is proportional to 1 by root of electric field so as electric field is going to be increasing mobility is going to be gets reduces with this relation mu is inversely proportional to square root of electric field so from this velocity equation drift velocity v is equal to mu into electric field we can say effectively velocity is now proportional to square root of electric field previously it was proportional to electric field now it is proportional to square root of electric field so as electric field is going to be increases during this portion 10 power 3 to 10 power 4 the velocity increase is going to be reduces even though the velocity increases but the increment is going to be reduces that is the increment is not as previous now if the electric field is greater than 10 power 4 volt per centimeter then mu is directly proportional to 1 by electric field so how much electric field is going to be increases by the same amount mobility is going to reduces that gives rise to drift velocity as constant because mu into electric field if electric field increases mu is getting reduces so the product is going to be always constant for the higher electric fields that is nothing but now the velocity is becoming constant velocity has been saturated so at this place this is this condition is going to be treated as constant velocity or velocity saturation region so we will summarize these three effects for small values of electric field V is proportional to electric field so this is what linear if you are looking at this curve this curve is between velocity versus electric field if the electric field is in between if the electric field is less than 10 power 3 then velocity increases linearly and afterwards whenever the electric field is in between 10 power 3 to 10 power 4 by that time 
the increment is going to be reduces even though the velocity increases but it is proportional to square root of electric field next whenever the electric field is greater than 10 power 4 that is c this portion velocity becomes constant that is constant velocity region or velocity saturation region so we can say like this drift velocity of electrons in silicon increases linearly with electric field at low values and gradually saturates at higher values of electric field so the correct option for this question is d thank you